Hey, what's going on? It's Rick here. And if you've got a Samsung Galaxy Note 8 or you're going to be picking one up and you're looking for a real functional case, I might have one that fits the bill for you guys. This is by Poetic. It's called the DuraBook. I've got it in white and purple. You'll see the purple in a minute here. And then black and red, which I'll demo the black and the red for you. It also comes in purple. I do not have that to show you today. And at least at the time of this video, this case is coming in right under $20. So it is pretty reasonable. And I'll link in the description of the video as to where you can pick it up. It is a faux leather, so it's not real leather. It's made to look and feel like leather without actually being it. There's those purple accents I was talking about. And they also serve purpose for a uh, stand uh, mode of this case, which I'll show you in just a moment here. Now let me go ahead and take the black and I'm gonna open this up and I'm going to pop the Galaxy Note right into this case case and then we can see what this is all about. So yeah, you see a camera cut out right there and I will demo that for you. This just slides right into place like you see here and then there's some Velcro here as well as on the inside and we're going to tuck that back into place and it'll fit just fine. We can close this up and let's go ahead and take a look at it up close. Now here is the front flap. You can see there is some poetic branding there. Otherwise it is all solid black. You've got some nice texture and it feels real nice in the hand. There's your spine and then here's the back side. Now notice there's a strap here. You don't have to use that but if you want to this is how that's going to work. So you can flip it around to the front just like this and then toss it in a bag or something and you don't have to worry about this front lid popping open on you. Now I will mention it does have magnets in it. They're not exceptionally strong so if you flip it upside down that front flap is going to stay closed but give it a little bit of a shake and it's going to open up on you. So I would advise using that. If we take a look at how everything is kind of lined up on this case, you've got access to what you need access to and there's no issue with that. So everything that you want to get access to, you certainly have it. There is a stylus holder right here. So if you want to put a stylus there, you certainly can. And then up along the top, it's looking good as well. When we open this up, it is going to awaken your device. When you close it, it's going to put it back to sleep. If you fold this around, this is what it's going to look like in kind of what I would call book mode. So it is going to add some bulk. And if you remember, there is that strap on the back. So if you wanted to use that to kind of keep that flat, I would say uh, open. You can certainly do that just like that and it's going to help it so it doesn't kind of flop open on you. But you know even if I don't use that uh, strap it doesn't really have too much of a problem keeping closed. You can hold it just like this. You're going to notice on the front there is a bordered design and it goes all the way around the edge like this. So it doesn't really cover anything up but if you're going to be doing a lot of swiping you may touch the borders. But typically in this style of case that's to be expected. Notice on the front flap we've got a couple of pockets here. You can put some memory cards or whatever SD cards in there. And then this is the red stripes that also serve as kind of your points for stands. So you get a stand just like that. You're going to get another one right in the middle there and then a third one right up atop here. You could certainly lay it all the way down like this or if you put it back into that book mode that I was talking about, you also get kind of a typing angle there. Now, the other thing is if you flip this open like this, there is your camera ac uh, access. But notice there's some Velcro here and if we pull this away, you can now use this case just like this or using these two and the Velcro here, let's go ahead and position this. It sticks to that and now you can use it in a stand mode just like this. So you have three different stands here. So it is very kind of functional in the sense that you can pretty much use this however you want. And it's nice that they've added the Velcro here so that you can kind of mix it up and change your positioning however you so desire. It's the DuraBook. It is for your Galaxy Note 8. I'm gonna give it a four and a half out of five. If you guys have questions, comments, or feedback, as always, please feel free to let me know. Otherwise, I'll catch you next time. Take care, everybody, and have fun.